Okay, so here's little me. Hi, everybody. I should be, I should be talking like this. I know, I'm not funny. Okay, so we're, after we have read chapters one and two of our new book, Save Me a Seat, and we have been introduced to our new characters, Joe and Ravi, we're going to go into our notebook and we're going to do today's reading, chapters one and two, the comprehension skill is compare and contrast. And we have a Venn diagram here that is used to compare and contrast. And so we need to show how both characters are the same and how they are different. So if you click on each section of the um, um, Venn diagram, you can actually type in it. So what I'd like for you to do is use bullet points. And to use bullet points, um, I just want you to use the little dash after the zero. All right, so I'm going to dash and then dash. Okay, very good. So we need to think about how Joe is different than Ravi. And I'll give you, a, um, by the way, the answers are not in your head. The answers are in the book. You should leaf back through the text and see if you can find some information that describes Joe. Look back and see if you can find information that describes Ravi. So Joe, we know is, whoop, American born. And Ravi, we know is Indian born. And we know that both of these are boys. So what I would like from you is I would like three bullet points in each box. So after you're finished with um, American born, just press enter and press another um, dash and each dash will be um, a bullet point. Now you can have as many as you want. If you can find a whole bunch, go ahead and put as many as you would like, but uh, especially if you're interested in the best notebook prize. However, you are required for a grade to have three in each. So I want you to leaf through your book and put down as many things that you know about Joe, as many things that you know about Ravi that make him different than Joe, and then how both of the boys are similar and put that down the middle section. And then you are finished with this assignment for the day.